Hi everybody, Larry Vela here from Bell Lost Souls, and today we're going to be taking a look at Gene Sealer Cult Acolyte Hybrids. Let's see what's inside the box. We, here we are, we have the Acolyte Hybrids box for Gene Sealer Cults, and uh, Adam, do you want to do the honors? I do. I, uh, I'm really excited about this one. Uh, here's the front of the box, obviously. I've been hanging out, waiting silently to strike. So here's the back of the box. We have a ton of the options here. I'm just gonna go ahead and rip this off real quick. We obviously have not opened this at all. I have no idea all the bits that are in here. But there's a lot. There looks like to be quite a few. So obviously the back of the box, just wanna show off some things real quick before we get in there. Uh, hybrid metamorphs. So we've got the leader. He's got some kind of crazy rending talon, rending claws and metamorph talon. We've got a metamorph Hybrid Metamorph with Cult Icon and Metamorph Whip. You can see the little whippy hand. Uh, leader with Metamorph Talon Auto Pistol. So there's a Talon, a Whip, a Claw, um, Chain Whip, or ch Chain Whip, <laughs> Bone Sword, Lash Whip combo here. There's the Heavy Rock Saw. Here's a Heavy Rock Cutter and a Heavy Rock Drill. So crazy weapons. This guy's got two sticks of dynamite, or two bundles of dynamite, blasting demo charges. That looks awesome. I also love. And this guy's got blasting charges. Is, look at the head. Like this guy has this cool little like his huge visor on. You gotta have safety first when you're dealing with explosives. Man. And like some of these guys, as I see, he has this cool visor on. The light. But I love how like he's wearing a safety visor and he has a safety visor and he just has a full tentacle gene sealer head. You know. With all the tentacles hanging out. Yeah. Showing up for work. Hey. Hey guys, I'm here with my hand flamer maybe. <laughs> just lunchbox. They should. Well, there should totally be a B A. I thought this guy had a lunchbox at first, but it was actually the lasting charge. If, they, if so. there was a lunchbox on a thermos, wow. They are miners, so we're gonna go ahead and dive into the box here. As a uh, tug on this, you can do it. All right, here we go. I'm just gonna boom. That's all the contents. The box is now empty, as you can see. Let's go ahead and lay this out real fast. So we've got. We'll just do one spur at a time. How about that? So first up, okay, let's flip that around. We have a plethora of heads. There's a lot of heads. That's that, more than five. And there's that many on this sprue too, so there's a huge amount. Is that the same sprue? Why did you have it to the side there? It doesn't look like the same sprue. Uh, it is not the okay, same sprue. Okay, so we so will go over these each separately. There are two sprues, they are different. So, so, wow. so really quick, I'm gonna do a head count. Ha ha ha. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, those are skulls, so those, those don't count, so five. Seven, eight, nine. There's ten there. Oh, these two are skulls. So there's ten there. Ten, eleven. Are there twenty heads? There are twenty heads on this. Wow. Thing, in, the, in this kit, so you will have tons of variety. Okay, that's that's good to know. Also, this is going to be really, really important because remember, um, if you get a couple of these, and then probably um, um, you're going to have extra heads that that you could use. Like if you're say wanted to do head swaps on Cadian bodies or things like that. So you're yeah, going to have yeah, lots yeah. of extra heads to do all kinds of neat conversions. That I think that's what they're going for in this set. Like you can obviously do a bunch of different customization and like you said, just kind of mix and match. I don't know if the, like, I wonder if you could do a Space Marine King Oh, right? don't even say that. Oh, I just burned the internet. All right. Don't even say that. Uh, anyway, sculpt wise, these look amazing. Like the detail on these is ridiculous. Yeah, it's Just really crisp. It's super crisp. It's Games Workshop quality. Uh, again, an incredibly stuffed sprue. I mean, there's no wasted space on this thing. No. There's just, and all the different weapons are here. And the and the the detail is it's really amazing. Like as an example, on a piece like this where you have a, a hybrid's um, the claw. arm. So you have the two Talon, arms on yeah. one side. Yes. Yeah. So you have the 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 the, the claw part here with, with the three glass. Uh, grasping, and then over here you have like a little mini version of oh, what, a crushing claw. Uh, no, of like a lictor. That's like a lictor. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah. Let me pull it's, it up. It's that here. weird kind of stabbing, like praying yeah. mantis thing. That's what that is. You can kind of see just the, the amount of detail on this. They packed on these is ridiculous. Here's the lash whip. Uh -huh. Here's another. Uh, that's an actual lash whip. You can tell because you can see the the hand right there, but this is actually attached. So that's. Right. That's like a, a oh, venom throat. It's like a biomorph. Yeah, that's a actually, biomorph. That's metamorph. growing out of him. Yeah, so that's that's actually. <laughs> yeah, he was born with that. That's his strong hand. You get, back, um, you get backpacks. That's that's the demo charge or the blasting charge. Excuse me. Um, it could be a lunchbox. Could be a lunchbox. I'm just saying. It could be. That a could be. That's a backpack of some type. All the different. There's auto pistols. Mm -hmm. There's the, uh, <laughs> the the demo charges. I love that. It's just a bundle of dynamite. That's. That's just cool. That's fantastic. Uh, there's the banner. This is really cool. And then there's the cutting, a uh, mining uh, cutter, and that looks like a mining laser of some type. So 
Man, these are fantastic looking sprues. All right. So let's look at the other one. Going to sprue numero dos. So you just, box es, comes with two sprues, 20 that, heads. That's <laughs> Espanol. Yeah, out there. In okay. the there's okay. the cutting saw. There's the cutting saw. There's two parts, actually. This is the this is the bad side of it, so let's flip it over. I don't know, this is some good detail. There we there go. You, now that, it's flat. Now it's There's flat. all the torsos. Yep. So you get all torsos, lots of them, fronts, backs. Again, another huge row of heads. And the thing about the hybrid heads is that not only are there 20 of them, but they're not, it's not like there's five and you get a lot of them. They, these are all different. So you're gonna yeah. get you're gonna get crazy options. There's there's I mean, that's a gene stealer Honestly, with a gas mask. I want to point this out real quick, too. If you look at them kind of side by side, um, some of these options are a lot less uh, gene stealery and more humanoid, and some of them are way more gene stealer looking, Tyranid looking right. than the others. Like these are obviously very, very gene stealer esque heads, right. whereas these up here are more, Much more kind of normal and humanoid. So it kind of represents the two different generations. Right. Of, of hybrids here, so. But you've got different legs, you've got the different buzzsaw there, that all buzz, the torsos. This buzzsaw is really, is a really nice piece. Really is it, nice is piece. It, uh, is it five torsos or are there, there are more than five torsos? One, two, three, four, five, six. Those are torsos. I think there's probably, I would guess that there's probably five One, legs two, is the limiting factor. Four. And then you're gonna get lots of um, torso Yeah, because there's different backpacks. Right. There's different backs and different then there's multiple torsos, but the limiting factor, I'm only seeing yep. one, two, it's three, uh, four, five sets of legs. Yeah. So there's your limiting factor. Yeah. But you get, you're going to, you know, if you buy a <laughs> couple of so these boxes, pits. you're going to have tons of extra heads, tons of extra arms, oh, yeah. all kinds of extra weapons. And 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 as, as we're saying, this kit, I'm not saying it's directly cross-bit compatible, but it's probably, there are definitely some of these elements that you could probably oh, wow. mess around with Cadians. Check that out. That is just like a bit that you put on a base. It's just a Cadian skull and a helmet you put on a base. Oh, that's great. That's that's awesome. There's just these little tiny flares. Well, there's there's Gene Sealer skulls. Yeah. Just a bit that's just a there's Gene Sealer skull. skull. If so, if you're actually like, you know, fighting Gene Sealers a lot and you want some skulls to decorate, you've got Gene Sealer skulls. Corn players. Hey, you need something to put on top of your banners. There you go. That, that too. Jeez, so, that is super cool. Um, look at the bases real quick. I think you get you get five bases. Or those are those are 32 mil bases. Yep. I just want to point that those out are. real fast. Um, let's take a look at the uh, instructions real quick. Mm -hmm. So, obviously this is how to build them. You've got the acolytes and the hybrid metamorphs. So, no shock there. What to do. Basic stuff. This isn't like the other ones I've seen where they've been in color. So, this is just the straight right. flat black and gray and white, whatever. Um, so pretty simple instructions though. Here's the option, all of the heads. <laughs> all of the Choose. Heads. Choose wisely. Or whatever, mix and match. Make mm. it maybe magnetize them if you're insane. The, the banner bear looks really good. Yeah. Really nice kit. Over here, same thing, tons of different heads to choose from. Oh, if you wanna have a different angle for the arm or maybe a different weapon. So that one is the cutter, the mining cutter. Yes. Rock cutter. And then I guess this one might be for maybe the, the that, drill or something? That's the outer section. It goes together. No, that's two two different arms? No, because it's a gene stealer. It has of two, course. He, he has the weird So he glues it arm. on there. There you go. Dun, dun, dun. Yes. That's an interesting way they cut that up. And again, looking at these, you can kind of tell how they cut stuff up. It really is going to hide the, the lines very well. This is the demo charge guy yep. with his big, his, <laughs> his two giant sticks of dynamite. I gotta be honest, without really knowing what the rules are for this guy, uh, that's probably one of my favorite models. This is already. Just because he's like, I dick dastardly. Because like, he's a gene stealer. Let's just put, put this in perspective. It's a gene stealer wearing rubber pants, carrying two sticks of dynamite, yes. and he has a gas mask on. I, that's a win. That's, that's just awesome. Yeah, he wins the style points competition. Yeah. Maybe I'll give him a different visor. I don't know, but whatever. It's just cool. Uh, Acolyte with a heavy rock saw. Yep, that's the huge giant circular saw that we've seen in in, in some of the pictures. Then here's uh, another counterpart. Is there's the big giant the the, the, the huge heavy drip rock the, drill. Yeah, the I want to point something out real quick drill too. Bit guy. Those bits do not overlap. I think maybe the body might. Let's see, is that eight A six A for the legs or body? No bit. I don't. I think you can actually build all these, all of these heavy weapons 
which would be super cool. So you can have one of each. Yeah. So I don't know what your options are yet in the rules, but once again, the limiting factor on these seems to be the legs. Yeah. But that's, that's super cool. Cents. And then there's the drill. Yeah, the drill. Oh man, act like hybrid. Here's another, and then it's just a generic dude. And it says like, how do you want to have them laid out? <laughs> so many different options there. And then because it's a Games Workshop kit, of course we get the rules. Awesome. And those are all in different languages too. So there's so. for the hybrids. For the hybrids. Oh, metamorphs. Real oh, right, quick. Right. There's these the are leader. Them. So. And these are the guys who are. These are the guys who are much more heavily mutated. Kind mm -hmm. of. They mm -hmm. have a lot more. They're much more tyranny and yeah. less carrying guns. Yeah. And he's got the uh, the claw. The weird lictor arm. And the metamorph with the uh, cult icon. The weird lictor arm. You'll, you're noticing that on the metamorphs, they're suggesting they're suggesting that you use the heads that are much more which makes sense. the yeah. much more tyrannish heads and, and the less kind of human human makes heads makes perfect sense on these and then the rules as well and then more options so yeah. and again side it looks like they have sighting talons rending claw close combat weapon um, a bunch of different options so and these hand flamers or something like that so very cool. Different language the rules. Man, there we go. That, guys, oh. that is the Acolyte Hybrids. Fantastic kit. I love it. Awesome. I'm gonna get like 30 of these. Not really. But and you're gonna need some Cadians to mix them in with. Yeah, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need to. Yeah. Yeah. I think you're oh, gonna yeah. do it. Here come the gene stealer cult. Yay! What do you got? I mean, I'm gonna go build these real quick. So I'll talk to you later. I'm out. Have a great one, guys.